For this test, the circuit is the one described in the QC2 control project and the Arduino Nano has been flashed with the basic control example demonstrating the use of the QC2 control library. Let's power it up with no charger attached and see the result. The output in yellow is 0 volt, of course, but one can see the levels on D plus and D minus trying to perform the handshake with a charger, then trying to control it. Let's reset the Arduino and plug the QC2 charger in. Now we can see that the charger starts at 5V, then it responds to the handshake and raises the voltage to 12V, then 9V, then surprisingly it drops to 0V before restarting at 5V, but handshake is not valid anymore and it stays at 5V. Let's reset the Arduino and try with the first QC3 charger. Unfortunately, this one does not seem to respond to the handshake and the QC2 control requests. Finally, let's try with the Anker QC3 charger. Reset. Plug in. And no luck either, the QC3 chargers seem to ignore the handshake and controls coming from the Arduino.